Libra, hello and welcome to your weekly reading with Angelic Ascensions Tarot. My name is Angela and your overall energy is the Queen of Wands in reverse. You're dealing with someone who is a diva, overly dramatic, um, someone who feels like they deserve life on a silver platter, possibly. For some of you, this is just a fire sign in Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. <clears throat> So some there you've got some sudden changes going on. You've got some sudden changes going on this week, Libra. Okay, so you are dealing with someone who's dramatic because we've got the tower here as well. <clears throat> you've got a, a lot of drama going on in your situation. Um, you've got issues where there's a lot of arguing. Communication is blocked. Communication is a factor. The two of you are not able to communicate effectively and someone is feeling stabbed in the back, feeling hurt over something possibly that someone said or someone's actions because someone in this situation is a player. You could be living as roommates with this person. This is supposed to be a love relationship, but someone, because they're not being honest, they're acting single and they're treating you like a roommate rather than a love partner. The passion has fizzled out in this relationship and your intuition could be cluing you in that something has changed. There is going to be a retreat. Someone is retreating from the relationship. They're backing away. Some of you could be dealing with um, a Virgo as well or have this placement in your chart. <clears throat> What's going on right now is a never ending story. This is something that continues to happen in your life, in your love relationship. And we have round and round as if the two of you are not able to resolve whatever this never ending story is. And something happened. I'm feeling like it's there's some type of deception and trickery attached to this situation. Uh, someone's in limbo. <clears throat> and then we've got balance here. Someone is trying to find their balance in the situation, trying to find a balanced perspective, weighing the pros and cons, or someone is needing to compromise in this situation. And someone is really in their head being, being an overthinker. There's been trickery. There's someone with this covert behavior. They are talking to an ex behind your back. Sneaking around with an ex. There was some type of an offer that was turned down in this situation. It could have been many offers. Someone's trying to seek answers as well here through prayer. Trying to figure out what the next move is going to be. Because the situation has crumpled. It's falling down. It has become unstable. And someone is having a lot of regret, remorse. This card was in the reverse. But I'm showing you what it looks like in the upright. Someone is having a lot of regret and remorse about things. And someone realizes, Libra, that, and this could be you, realizing that the situation isn't going to change. You're not going to get the compromise that you were hoping for. You're dealing with a situation that you feel is unfair and you're considering walking away and becoming single. And someone will ultimately release the other in the situation because the truth will be will come out. And so Libra, it is time to choose a new direction. Okay, so for some of you, You've got an ex coming in, and this is a soulmate. This is someone who could have been a bit of a player in the past as well. And you spent many sleepless nights, and some of you are spending, currently spending sleepless nights worrying about what decision to make. Because I'm feeling as though someone has fear of the unknown. Fear that if they walk away, that their life is going to be torn apart. Someone in your situation is like very overly emotional and very dramatic and overreacts to the situation. <coughs> Excuse me. 
And Libra, you recognize that you're not going to get a victory out of this situation. And that could be what's having you up at night worrying. But the positive to the situation is that although you feel broken hearted and there is a lot of tension in this relationship, you have something new coming in. Well, the ex is, someone has to make a decision because someone is in limbo. Someone's acting in a very vain way. Someone has to make a decision about who they want to be with. And so that's what this balance is about. Gaining a balanced perspective. Like I said, weighing it out, weighing the pros and cons. What direction do you want to go in? But like I said, well, like the advice card said, it's time to choose a new direction. So we've got this retreat. Someone is taking a respite, taking a break from the relationship. There is a recovery period that's going on in your situation. <clears throat> and some of you are, are, are hoping for something new. You're co-creating. You are trying to pull in something in your life that is more meaningful and more... Um, uh, that is a better fit and matches your current vibration. King of Cups in reverse. Your partner, this is either you or your partner. It could be a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, or you're dealing with someone who is drinking, overindulging in alcohol, and you're going to find out about the third party. But that doesn't end the relationship here, Libra. Someone from the past is coming in, and this is someone who is very reliable. <clears throat> Nine of Pentacles. And we have go the distance. This is someone who will be there for the long haul. We are talking about the ex that is returning to the situation. So someone will ultimately walk away. And someone could be waiting to hear someone's decision. And someone might be fighting for this relationship. Some of you are dealing with a Sagittarius. If not, someone is trying to find patience and balance. Again, weighing the pros and cons. Weighing the situation out and figuring out what the best choice is. Some of you could be dealing with an Aquarius as well. You're still having hope. And like I said before, this soulmate connection is coming into your life. But it is going to take singlehood for that to take place. <clears throat> So this person is your destiny. They are destined to come into your life. And you also have an abundance in your situation, Libra. We have windfall of abundance. What this card says is an increase in abundance is arriving in many different forms. Some of them unexpected. Be open to receiving and know that this abundance comes to you to support your life, purpose, health, and charitable work. So you have finances. You have a financial windfall of abundance coming in, without a doubt. This could also be an abundance of love as well. So abundance isn't always financial. You have something very promising, something that will stand the test of time and will be there for the long haul. <clears throat> something that will indeed go the distance. And this will happen within the next few months. Okay. And remember, Libra, to be assertive and state what it is that you really want in this situation. Because some of you may be afraid to speak up, you know, because like I said, fear of the unknown could be what's causing you to not come forward and make a decision. And so I'm seeing that someone from the past is going to come through with a firm offer of commitment. Some of you could be dealing with a Taurus or you have this in your chart. <clears throat> Holy Spirit, what additional word of advice do you have for Libra? I almost said Taurus. I'm, I'm strongly feel. I know I just pulled the, the Hierophant, but I'm hearing strong. I'm feeling strong Taurus energy here for some of you. We have success. So this is something that is destined, something that will be successful for you. And you will have success in your financial, the financial sector of your life as well, Libra. Okay, with that said, that 
And that's your reading. And do me a favor, if that resonated, hit the like button below and feel free to leave me a comment. And for those of you who are brand new to my channel, I invite you to subscribe and I thank you for watching. And I thank all of you for watching and for uh, returning to my channel, returning subscribers. You all are appreciated. And if you're interested in booking a personal reading, you can reach me at angelicascensionstarot.com. And of course, you can email me at angelicascensionstarot at gmail.com. And of course, Instant Go is another quick way to reach me. Uh, you can reach me at Instant Go if you are an Apple iPhone user. The developers of the app are working on getting it available to Android, and that will be sometime within um, the ending phase of this year into the beginning phase of next year. So Android users, very soon that will be available. We can open up a chat dialogue and we can talk about your particular situation. And this, let this be something that you're not needing extensive guidance on because you'd be better off with a personal reading in that case. So this is a relatively more inexpensive way to speak to me about your situation. So if you have just a quick question, I can answer that for you on the Instant Go app. All right, everyone. Thank you again, and I'm wishing you a very successful and happy week. Bye for now.